Hey, you want to hear a sentence that you either have no idea what it means or you'll hate me for making me remind you of it? Draw a circle, that's the earth. My god, what have you done?! Really excited to go up to the mountain with my dad to sacrifice a lamb. Looks like you forgot to bring the sacrifice, but I'm just happy to take a walk with him. Hey, OP, any updates? Hey, OP? Master post of fish names I really like. Delta Smelt, Boops, Sweet Lip Emperor, Wahoo, and Slippery Dick. A lot I could say, it's a fish. Heart Reflection Kingfisher. Jesus, I thought those were its legs. Making my way downtown! Honestly, the concept of doppelgangers is scary, but if I saw myself, I probably wouldn't be that terrified. Like, I know she can't run for more than three minutes straight. I know she can't do basic maths. She's not gonna do anything. She doesn't even know what day it is. <laughs> Self-depreciating humor at its finest. Get yourself some ham belper herger. I'm high and this killed me. Dude, this knocked me back into a high just to kill me. Reblog if your URL represents who you really are. I am really Putin's girlfriend. Then we have a problem. I can explain it. When I was 12, my sister told me that Greek people went extinct, and that's why we learn about Greek mythology in school. And I was like, but there's a Greek boy in my class. And she told me that he didn't exist. She's not wrong. Uh, okay. Fun fact, the word panic is actually from the Greek... Greek, oh my god. The word panic is actually from the Greek word panikos, which is referring to the Greek god Pan, who apparently shout at people who are alone in the woods and freak them out. Oh snap, those are career goals. Don't look at me in that tone of voice. What? Biology tells you you're 70% water. Chemistry tells you you're 60% oxygen. Physics tells you you're 99.9999999999% empty space. And I tell you you're 100% a cutie. Dad. That was lame. Okay, but what if- Homie, we went over this like a hundred times yesterday and we totally resolved it. Yeah, but I like looked at it from a new angle and there's like 20 more reasons why you should be worried about it. Go on. Big Bang Theory is awful for obvious reasons, but honestly, shout out to them for inventing Bazinga, so I have a word I can drop to any conversation for a one-hit kill. Bazinga and Every Pony are the closest we'll ever get to real dragon shots. Carve this into your mind, Dova King. Hello, every pony bazinga. Now shout. Hello, every pony bazinga! Reminder that my roommate once painted Alexander Hamilton as Ham. Well, now I'm just sitting here imagining helpless, but she's holding Ham Hamilton the entire time. Total drama was way ahead of its time. It really was. Okay, campers, I heard from an anonymous source that somebody told the government we're going to storm Area 51. Not. Cool, dudes. Paladin, when you're kind of feeling cleric, but also want to stab. Sorcerer, when you want to be a caster, but you don't want to be a nerd. Bard, when you've never made a decision in your life and you don't intend to start now. Warlock, when you're not quite ready to admit you're into cryptids like that. Druid, when honestly you'd rather be on the floor petting the DM's cat, but they made you play and this is the best thing, you guess. Fighter, when all the weird puzzle shit bores the snort out of you and you'd rather stack dice till the fighting part gets here. Rogue, when you've never solved the problem in your life, and in fact have caused many, and you're just fine with that, honestly. Me, circa early 1800s, paying a stable boy a few coppers to ride overnight to deliver you an urgent letter with a thick wax seal that after you struggle to break it just says, bitch, in tiny little writing. No, 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 you don't understand the true level of spiteful here. The sender of a letter didn't pay for the post in 1800. The receiver did. You just made your enemy pay for the privilege of being insulted. I'm starting to see why messengers were getting shot. Writers always know exactly where they're going with their work. Are you sure? No writer does anything by mistake. It's all very strategic. Are you sure? They use symbolism in everything. For example, a simple sentence symbolizes directness and- Are you sure? The best moments in writing is when you discover you did something absolutely genius by complete accident. Honestly, Minecraft is a good game and I'll never forgive the internet for making people feel bad about liking a game about f***ing mining and building houses! You know what? Good post, OP. Remember to drink water, babes. No. Then become the dirt I walk on. Every post like this hits me so hard because OP always swings back with a new type of bat and I'm never prepared for it. This is obviously a misunderstanding. You knocked a cyclist off his bike with a pool noodle. No, I didn't. Yes, you did, you asshole!